absolutely love the idea of bringing the Youth Ag Summit alumni into this uh, Future of Farming Summit because I feel like it brings a really interesting perspective. Uh, the majority of the people in attendance are seasoned journalists and seasoned bloggers. So you're able to bring in um, ideas from a different generation. You're able to bring in experiences from something that's impacted a community of, of future agriculturalists worldwide. And I feel like it's a great tie between where the current agriculture industry is and what the future agricultural industry will look like. Uh, it's interesting to get to know uh, uh, different youth from different countries, of course, and that's why the Youth Ag Summit is also uh, very important for us to get all those visions to uh, our country uh, so we can learn from them. There are delegates here from our Youth Ag Summit. Um, this is where we get basically a uh, hundred of, of the most creative and, and brightest minds who are interested in agriculture, young people, and they go back and, and they basically spread what they have learned to, to their communities. We went with our idea, but we left with 130 other ideas, so it was all about networking and um, keeping young people uh, interacting again with each other to find solutions and to think outside the box, actually. I can do something for agriculture by using ICT, so it was a great experience for me because I could go to the digital farming place and see like, what they're doing, so I learned like idea. And so I, I'm thinking about how I can do in Japan. Well, I think uh, Belgium is actually an amazing place to host the summit because first of all, um, our capital is Brussels. The city where it will take place is also the capital of Europe and the place where uh, all agricultural policies are made.